What's up everybody? I'm Turbo and welcome back for another Turbo unboxing. Today we have the BAM box. Try to surprise you on that one. From December 2017. It is now January, but you know, these usually ship uh, between the 21st and the 28th of the month, so it's frequently my last box that I get. Um, it's usually worth the wait. I like the BAM box. It's a lot of fun. Um, they were hyping up the celebrity autograph this month as someone who had been in four different major franchises. So, um, let's check it out. All right, black paper on top like usual. I'm going to take a look. Okay, this is fun. Of course it's fun. Why wouldn't it be? We're starting off with a Christmas Story mini leg lamp kit. I have a pretty big one, a uh, half size I think, leg lamp. I'm a huge Christmas Story fan, so I'm excited about this. Oh, it comes with paper packing. It's fragile. You have to be careful with it. <laughs> okay, so it does glow. It's hard to tell. There's a little switch on top. Oh yeah, you can tell. Camera totally fixed that up. But it's not bad. It comes with a little booklet. Ooh, with some pictures. Ralphie with the bar of soap in his mouth. And they're like, oh, they're stickers. Wow, it comes with a little sticker book. Very cool. Oh, I could have just read the cover. A story in stickers. But this is a lot of fun. Right up my alley. Cool. Good job so far, Bandbox. Ooh, and I see the magical one-up card. So that means something in this box is upgraded. This is the original Bandbox. I just did the horror one, and that's the only reason I know this is the original. Oh, this is Dean's dog detecting amulet from Supernatural. Well, that's actually pretty cool. All right, it's kind of a weird Indian godhead, some sort, on a necklace. Uh, a pretty simple chain or cord, but uh, adjustable. I like that. Let's throw it on right now. All right, there we go. Supernatural has been recommended to me several times by several people. I just have not gotten around to it yet. It is on my list. I got We got one of these in the horror box. This one I like a lot more. It is a Nightmare Before Christmas, like Million Dollar Bill. I'm not sure what we can spend them on. Probably nothing. But here it's neat. <clears throat> I may have to look up the spoiler booklet and come back there. Posting them online now. Um, which is cool. I mean, saving paper is good and everything. It would be nice to have like a card or something just to look at. Um, and here is Ho. Our pin is from uh, National Lampoon's Vacation, Christmas Vacation. And this is the mug that they drink the eggnog out of. Ooh, and this is limited. And this here is my one-up on the back. It says it's limited to only 500. What number do we have? Two fifty-nine. This is number two fifty-nine out of five hundred. So now this is going to be valuable on the swap and marketplace. People really love these pins. I'm not a big pin collector, so anytime I get a one-up, um, it's uh, looking for trade. So I'll be throwing that out. Although, if not, that's cool, too. I mean, I, it's a cool pin. It's very cool. All right, let's go. I believe the sketch is on top. Usually is okay. Not sketch, print. They give us a print signed by the artist. Um, COD, we've had him before. Um, uh, create and destroy. Create or destroy, I think. I can't tell who the new person is. Life. High on life splendor. So this is basically the Bob Ross Deadpool, painting with Bob Ross, inspired by that fun trailer where he's painting the family family picture and everything. And I've loved Bob Ross all my life, I think, and Deadpool's awesome. Um, he's always been my favorite character, but I really like what they're doing with the movies, and he's becoming, um, he's becoming one of them, I think. I say movies, assuming I'm going to like the second one already, but I don't see why I wouldn't. Okay, and they've been hyping up this celebrity photo, or the celebrity autograph this month. They said it was in four major franchises. Uh, oftentimes they get voice actors or um, puppeteers and stuff like that. Um, for the cost of the box, it's tough to get like a really major celebrity to come and sign. But they do some pretty good stuff. And this is Deep Roy. Oh, okay. I know who Deep is. So he plays in uh, Star Trek, uh, the new Star Trek, the reboot, with the young cast opposite Simon Pegg. He plays the little alien guy. And I recognize him also. I believe he was one of the stand-ins in Lord of the Rings. I believe he was in Lord of the Rings. I remember watching a um, uh, documentary about it, and he was in there. And uh, they say he's been in Star Wars too. I assume maybe he's a droid or a small alien. 
Um, but I may look out and see which other um, photos he has. I was trying to avoid it because I didn't want spoilers. But now that I know who's in there, well, I'm interested and we'll, we'll see what else there was. Um, again, they didn't do the spoiler book that this one would have been a good one to do it for. Um, but they're phasing that out. I don't know if they're trying to save costs or paper or what. Either way, you know, it's up to them. But <clears throat> it's nice to have, like, at least a sheet and that kind of stuff. So maybe I'll look it up and come on back. But, um, you know, maybe not. If you really want to know, look it up yourself. Use the Internet. Use your brain. Grow your brain. It's amazing. Anyway, thank you for joining me. Come on back and join me again for more Turbo Unboxings. Tell your friends. Like this video. Leave a comment. And until next time, be excellent to each other. Why not do that? You don't know what